Hello everyone, it's Metal Monster here, and we are back in Legend of Zelda. I hope everyone's doing okay. I today am going to... Well, I want to discover the the tower regions for... I believe it was this region and this region, maybe. And maybe this one. So, I guess we're going to explore a little. And I'm pretty sure I've been to all the stables at the moment. So it's just uh, it's just a matter of finding something else to do, or finding some more stables, to be honest. So we got a speedy horse. I There was a new update for the game, so I've installed that. Just to help it, I guess. Because I think there was some... Well, I think they were patching some, uh, what do you call them, duplication glitches and stuff like that. And they don't like that, so... Thought, hey yo, may as well install it. I'm not going to be duplicating anything anytime soon anyway. Just feels a bit cheaty doing that. This looks like a lot of baddies. I can do more. in the best position. Come on, do the dodge thing. There we go. Ow. Been lasted a while. There we go, got one. Ow, spikes. There you go. At least all those, uh... All those guys are defeated. Talking to me. So, uh, there is anything special? Bringing you to. Can I ever say that? Hatino. Hatino? Hatino? Hatino. Hatino village at this hour? 
All we have here are veggies, CC's fashion, and just those two things, really. So, you know, not much point of attacking our homes or anything. <laughs> oh, he's actually pretty handsome now, I thought I'd get a good look. Hey, I have a good idea. You should take this and not ask any questions. You swept me off my feet so fast that I gave you one of my prized eggs. No more, though. Forget what just happened here today. How could I ever forget? Mm. Your heart is like a <laughs> easily given, but easily to break. <laughs> okay. Oh. Well, I, okay. Now I saw a twisty green somewhere. Well, at least we know that dragon still roams the skies over there. Oh, I'm passing through the village. What am I doing? The die man's still there. I sense a quest here. As I said multiple times now, I can't admit three customers at the present. What do you mean? We took all the trouble to come here and now you're saying we can't get in? When I want to see CC's new stuff. It's not every day a mega famous fashion designer debuts new material. Mm. Yeah, everything I heard said this was some of CC's best work. I am so sorry. So sorry. But we only have one entry ticket remaining. Mm. One ticket? So you're saying one person can get in? Mm. How come we can't just let one of us get in a head start? <laughs> sure, I know, that was the joke. Ah. Well, maybe come back later, they'll have room for all of us. Ah. Yeah, it's not like the only clothing place in the village. What do you say we go to the dye shop? Oh, or could we could check out the pasture. <laughs> Speaking of which, I've heard that there are little ways on the road. There's a pasture. It's a lab laboratory specialising in ages and stuff. Mm. Since we all get rolled up. Since we all got dolled up. I just sneezed really heavily then, sorry. Uh, we may as well hit the town and see it all. That's a good way of explaining. Thank goodness they gave up. Oh. oh, I'm sorry to keep you waiting. Uh, are you also a tourist who's came to see my sisters? I mean, the new line of CC's products. Oh. As long as you're just free to go into the shop. CC herself is in there right now. Nothing you'll see is for sale. It only have an exposition right now. Sorry to disappoint. Well, there's, there's nothing here. Oh. Hello. No. Another practically perfect masterpiece. It's an exemplar of the form of from every angle. What? Uh -huh. Oh, pardon me. Are you an admirer here to meet the incomparable CC? Hmm, I must say, you don't seem to show any sort of interest in fashion. Ooh. Welcome to Fantas Clothing, the only boutique in the world which carries the CC brand, and if you weren't aware, no. you stand before the very woman who changed the Fusty old village into the birthplace of... Oh, God. She made the mushroom stuff, didn't she? As proof, I present to you this. No. The CC hat. The newest and most magnificent work by yours truly, CC. <laughs> Do you see that luxurious curve, Dean? Oh, God, please don't. Yeah, it's, it's fantastic, lady. It's basically your head. 
Yeah, it's so special. I shall only part with it when I find someone truly worthy of owning it. <laughs> only the most impressive fashion. Oh, right. High Royal Trendiest Village is worth such a crown. <laughs> What's all this about High Royal Trendiest Village? I don't remember proving any new slogan for Hatuna. Ah, uh, look who's here. What can I do for you, oh esteemed Mayoridi? I'm really sorry, I tried to stop him from coming in like you'd asked, but he wouldn't take no for an answer. See, see, you, you have to quit littering the village with your weird art pieces. <laughs> Maybe you don't realize, but plants need their sleep too. Those eyesores are so bright at night that you're keeping the veggies awake. It's a real problem for the crops. I don't know foundation is that produce. What are you going to do if it all fails? Aww. Now, now, dear. There's no need to get so worked up. I think some people are actually like her art, you know? Wouldn't it be better to hear her out? Don't fall for the line of twaddle. She's got everyone and had to wrapped around her finger already. My duty is to look after the village, and that's what I need to do. Uh -huh. Looking after the village, you say? Who do you suppose do you have to thank for Hatu's re rejuvenation? It didn't need rejuvenating. Hatu village is a peaceful place where folks live quiet lives, and that's the way we like it. <laughs> Do they? Then let us leave the matter to the people to decide. My avant grand approach versus the mayor's quaint bygone ways. Bygone ways. This, the citizens will decide which outlook will drive the future of the village. <laughs> By holding a mayoral... Oh, a mayor election, basically. You're calling for a yep an election yep. Sure suits me. I'll win that pretty easy. Uh. Sophie, I delegate management of the mayoral. Uh, I can't say it right. The mayoral. It's weird. It, it goes strange on the tongue. Eh. Oh, what? <laughs> Come on, Flavia. I don't feel like sticking around here. Time to head back home. Okay. How are you again? Ooh. I've got a long to-do list with the preparation for the mayoral election. Mayoral, May mayoral. I can't say it. That's so weird. Yeah, for the election. Um, the answer should go without saying. CC voter. Uh, undecided. No. Oh, if you haven't thrown your hat in, in your lot with either candidate, then. Welcome to the team, CC. Oh. That settles that, I trust. It's plain for all those to see that I am shoe in for the next mayor. Oh. Or one would think. Yet there are... Stragglers in this village that's still supporting Reed. They need a me mental makeover. <laughs> and so, I have a fabulous plan to give out mushrooms. Ooh. Yeah, mushrooms are. Oh god. Why do you have to make that weird squirting noise? No. What the hell? Uh, sure, I'll, I'll do it for you. Is mushrooms or villages? Okay. Oh my god, that noise is horrible. Uh -huh. To children, travelers, or any temporary residents like the Sheikah researchers. That leaves us with, unless I miss my guess total, eight. Well, uh. 
She saddled me with so much work when she put me in charge of the mo with the mayor election. I don't care. Oh. Um, sir? I feel should oblige for dragging you into this mess I found myself in. But since you are both involved, could you please give me a little advice? Oh. Sure. I should have expected that. The thing is, I need you advice on my CC. It's about CC. Lately, she's been sneaking off alone in the middle of the night. I don't think it's anything sinister, but the election is soon, and I don't want any last-minute surprises to her to chances. So I'd like you to detail her. Oh, I could do that. I tried following herself, but she spotted me right away. I really got an earful about it too. If you succeed in finding out what she's doing, I can reward you, of course. You're the only one to ask for help. I don't want to leave the village find out until I know what's going on. Help me out, please. God, this village is just full of quests. Yeah. Go right in. Wait a second, are you in a house here? I guess I'll go work. Don't do it, make your own. Oh, well. Got your hot toad. Adoop. It's almost on its way out. <laughs> ruby, 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 ruby. <laughs> Damn it. I think there was a. Oh, hello. <laughs> I don't think that'll do. I actually need some more weapons. There we go, something to bash some rocks with. A big toad. So there's clearly some bad guys. I've been playing a game and I can't remember what game it was before that. Ah, yes. I was playing some, uh, some Destiny 2. You know what's on it? Oh crap. Do you spit anything? Giant seeds are useful. That's another thing I need to do. Need to go down more in the deep dark deep down. If you get that reference, you're a legend. If not, you're still a legend. Oh, I thought I grabbed that one. That's oh, that's not all. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, hello. noises. There we go. Yep. Gumbos haven't decayed. <coughs> Go on, give me something sharp. Shield of the mind's eye. Well. <laughs> Why is this here? I'm glad wells can be very odd. <laughs> We're back to the beginning. Okay, cool. I got the rock thing. Here we go. Oh, my alarm's going off. Here we go. Whack a mushroom. <laughs> Just noticed my X button has been a bit sticky. Not sticky as in that it's like sticking in the hot. Uh, <laughs> oh god. Never mind. The 
This should break it. Feels like another well. <laughs> yeah, they're all wells. Right, let's uh, ascend. Scoop it out. Scoop it out. Oh. What does that do? I'm guessing it rotates, maybe? Yeah. Okay. So by the sounds of it, scoop it out sounds like we need to... Scoop it out. Make a scooper. Oh, God. I saw it. Ah, oh, no, that I didn't want to do. I kind of want to make like a scooping thing. So we can scoop up so it doesn't. There we go. So nothing can like drop by the wayside. Something like that. That should work, right? And it's got nobles whatsoever in it. What the hell? <laughs> Go back down. Now wanna do your damn job. <laughs> Can I not scoop any of these balls in? As if it didn't grab any. That's pretty funny. Oh well, at least it at least it's got one. <laughs> what the hell? No, that's not an. Uh... Try that again. Helping my case here by doing that. Just get another, just two balls. Can I ascend into that? Oh, 
I went through the bowl. Uh oh. I almost, <laughs> I almost got trapped between two bowls. Oh no. I need one. Where's the chest in this one? I'm guessing the chest is probably all the way in there. I can't not be the slightest bit bothered to get that chest out of that pit of balls. At least without that targeted. Oh. My house is around here, right? Oh god, my parachute wanna trigger them. Yeah, this is Link's house from Breath of the Wild. Looking good. The trees are doing good. They grow up eventually. Wait a minute, where are all my armories and stuff? Who's this? this is definitely my house now, right? Golden horse. A random lady. Cooking up some fierce food. This is not my house anymore. Zelda's journal? In my house? What's going on here? After the calamity, I asked myself how to rebuild and set out across Hyrule and search for an answer. I saw the collapsed buildings, lost cities, and damage was far worse than I had imagined. But as I watched the people and heard their stories, I was convinced all was not lost. The people's spirits were not broken. They and their strong wills are Hyrule's greatest treasure. They are the ones who, re who will rebuild, and my contribution to their efforts will have to protect them. As part of Hyrule's reconstruction, we've built a school in Hataru village. It's the largest Hylian village, with its sprawling, bountiful land. There are plenty of children living here, that it seemed the ideal place to be, to found a school, yeah? I've... Recreated Sim from the research institution to the teacher there. He was Peru's assistant for years. Oh yeah, poor Pure is not Peru's. Pure is uh, assistant for years, which makes him a well equipped to deal with needs of quirky children. Ah, <laughs> that's funny. I'll be overall. Okay, yeah. Where's the part where you nicked my house? I commissioned Bolston, who taught his trade to H Hudson of Hudson Construction to construct the school for us. He seemed deeply moved by the request. Uh, this will be his final job in Hataru Village before he sets off on a journey. I had him add a secret room to my house, one that would appear on the plant plans. It's dim, but humidity and temperature controlled, so it's very well comfortable. It's proven very useful when I'm working alone and need uh, to concentrate. Work on the school has been moving along smooth. Wait, there's a secret house layer, layer thing in here. Where? Okay, uh, we don't have enough teachers. Simnim is interviewing people, uh, but hasn't found a good fit yet. I'd like to hire someone intelligent, dedicated, capable of earning the children's trust. Nurturing our children is an extension of the of our duty to this land. We shape our future by the way we shape their path. I hope to see sterling members of our community come to this village, take up the mantle as their teacher. I commissioned Bolston, who taught his trade to Hudson of Hudson Construction, to construct the school for us. He seemed deeply mo- oh, wait, what? Oh, okay, I'm, I'm... Can I sleep here? I can sleep in my bed. Ha 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 ha. It is not Zelda's anymore. It is mine again.
Oh God! And the glow of the blood-stained moon shines upon the land. The endless spirits of slain monsters return to flesh. The world is threatened once again. Well, thank you for that interjection, Zelda. After reading your personal journal, I see I was wrong to do so. Yup. Yup, indeed. So, she nicked me house, evicted me. Took all my weapons down. And added a secret room somewhere where I have no idea what the... Oh, that's some malice hole thing. Zelda's secret well. Hey, let's get down here. Whee! This is the... that's the Breath of the Wild hair, default hair. Oh, that's ace to have. Oh, cool. I'll keep that on whilst in the village. Read Zelda. Though the calamity is over, its scars remain. A mountain of problems stand before us. Even as we begin to rebuild, no matter where I go, I offer aid. Link remains by my side. A kindness that has taken a visible toll on his clothing. That's why I've put the or the order of a new improved. What? That's why I've put in an order for the oh, okay the new improved champion's tunic just for him. I just can't wait to see uh, see the look on his face when I surprise him with it. I'll hide it in the throne room, so we won't find it until after our investigation. Even. He would never expect that the torches are the key. Oh man! Where's that now? In the throne room. Oh my, the torches are the key. Well. In the throne room. I'm not gonna get into Hyrule Castle. <laughs> not until like late game. I guess that's a good place to put it. <laughs> well, at least I know where the. Th Hopefully, uh, whoever that rotten dude was isn't uh, sitting on the throne room with my armor. Hello. Course is all the way up there. Well, you're staying there, my friend. Right, I think I recall if I run to the research lab. I'm I'm happy I got that old band. That's cool. This is that's definitely the Breath of the Wild, so A little, little nod to Breath of the Wild with the old hairband. Although I wish I could just wear it normally. I wonder if the fairy could approve it. Probably not. Ah, I got you. They should have introduced uh, fishing or something. Like you grab a fishing rod and you can fish. Are these houses new or did I? 
I don't know. Wind's good again today. Don't know why he's texting. The cuckoos are cuckoo. Fast rest a little. Hey, what do you want with an old man like me? I uh, have a highly inch room. You said it's from sea? Well, that's generous of her, thanks. What's this? A fine looking mushroom you brought me. Seems like lately Cece's mushrooms are popping up everywhere. Mm. Makes my eye water a bit seeing those flashy colors whenever I turn. My family and my family, I know my families of my age tend to be, tend to take life slower than she does. Still and all, it'll be rude to turn down a generous gift. Thank you. Tell you that Sheikah light thing better be on. I ain't relighting it. Totally gone, eh? Need to get inside? Come find me at... Oh, okay. Rummy. Wonder if there's anything upstairs. Wait, why did Robbie leave that message? This is pure space. Nothing to loot here. Whoop, almost flew off the edge. Read Pierre's diary? Read. I grew frustrated with being treated like a child, so I resumed my age boosting experiments in earnest. With the anti aging device, I reversed more than a hundred years uh, in an instant. So I reflect on the result and moderated the output. When I cautiously expose myself to this, to its rays, I return to my 20-year-old form. 20-year-old form, that's cool. Just as I hoped. Success! So I'm happy that I can once again reach the high places without using a jetpack. My 10-year-old body doesn't suffer from sleepless nights uh, researching. And once more, my skin is perfect. No complaints. Three volumes of my diary are hidden away now. I'll place the last one at the northeastern edge of Akalara. The lab there is perfect for hiding things. It's such a remote location. I'm sure no one will ever come across it. Oh, the door closed itself. Ah, so she remodified herself. Didn't know this was cyberpunk. So that light, it would unlock this section. That light over there would... Come on. Would unlock that section. Cool. A cool little cherry tree there. Or oh, blossom tree, sorry. I should be able to just jump down and then probably head up around. Let's get some gold resistant going. Legendary treasure, you say? Hello, my name is Nesby. 
I'm a treasure hunter and adventurer, extraordinary. Undaunted by even the coldest snow. This area is frozen solid and is packed with monsters. No one in their <laughs> right mind would set for here. Ah! Except me, of course. There surely must be treasure resting here at the top of the mountain. Where everyone else fears to tread. That's what drove me to travel all this way to Mount... Oh, I can never say that. Lanerlu. Until I saw you. I really thought I'd be the only one here. Yep. The truth is, I'm sheer luck and overheard a legend, a legend relating to the treasure on this mountain whilst I was on the way here. Aye. There's the treasure hunter. Nothing to hide. The legend goes like this: Skim across the snow from the spring high in the heavens to the mountain below. Pass through the rings of light to see the light of blessing. Ah! What do you think the real legend is of the real treasure passed down by the very mountain? And do you know the same name that light of blessing? There's got to be treasure. Okay. I suspected spring high in the heavens is referring to the spring. The treasure is... Okay, so it's... Oh. Except to find it apart from the rings of light bit. I won't give up though. Aye. Okay. Rings of light. <laughs> Devout swordsman who offers his prayers, hear my plea. I can no longer sense the presence of the Mother God Goddess statue which dwells in the vast canyon. I would ask you to go and to that land and bring tidings to me of the Mother Goddess statue. Please, I beg of you. Oh, crap. Is it that the same place where... Uh... Where uh, Duda wants me to go. Dragon's Tear. It's close to that area, isn't it? Okay. First, I want to unlock this area. Let's head up here. Hopefully it's not a bunch of hands again. It was difficult getting up here. I have to head all the way. Thought I was hearing drums then. Nice. No hitch, that's good to see. Let's get this data. Some sky islands I can explore. Cool. Now, rings of light. I 
I can see a dragon. What's that there? So that's the campfire. Don't see any rings of light, unfortunately. Yeah, it's probably a good idea to save. Thank you, switch. See a shrine over there, though. At least I can teleport straight back to the mountain, which is nice. Must be a tear over there somewhere. Need to get one more heart just to make it a little bit make me a little bit more tougher. I'm very interested about that cave behind me. Jailbreak. What are you trying to do here? Can I even jump up that? No. Move along. There we go. Magic staff. That's new. I only need a little bit. Tarnation. Well, how do we get back down?
Unfortunately, gonna have to use one of these Zonai things. Oh, which you can't. You literally can't. That's interesting. That would make everything too easy. I can't get out now. Ah, wait a second. <laughs> Ah, uh, this camera. It's a good job that was there. Guy would be screwed. Bling. Six. I need two more. Let's get another one of these. And, uh, okay, so I'm going to call it an episode here. Then in the next one, we're going to head into that cave and do some stuff. So, yeah, I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.